I'm Sue Lovelace here at the Straw Bale Studio in Oxford. Today we are talking with Deanne, director of the Straw Bale Studio, about alternative heating options. So this is a Rumford fireplace. And Count Rumford invented this around the time of Benjamin Franklin. And he made the regular fireplace, or the old previous fireplaces, more efficient in design by making the firebox more shallow, so bringing the heat out towards the room, and then also taking the sides of the, of the firebox and slanting them outward so that the heat of the fire radiates out and doesn't get blocked by this wall, doesn't run into the side walls. So it allows the heat to come out in the room from all angles. And it's very efficient at heating space over what we'd call the traditional square firebox. And this was made out of mostly out of cob, which is our clay sand straw mix. Um, when we're around fire places, we usually leave out the straw, except maybe in the, the very uh, outer layers. And a little bit of brick in the back for protection um, against just uh, the physical uh, pushing against of the, the logs here. A little bit of bricks. I think next time, <clears throat> though, I would do it without the bricks and just try cob and see how it works. And then the rest of it is, you know, up to people as to how it's going to be sculpted. But this is a basic concept and it works really well. And I loved being able to do something this practical. I had a neighbor who does metalwork fabricate a damper for inside here so that can be used to open and close it. And all the materials except the bricks are local and they were recycled. And I can just harvest the wood uh, and sticks out of the forest as I walk along or along the pathways. And that's my joy, is just to harvest like that. For more information, contact the Straw Bale Studio at www.strawbalestudio.org.